right, hey, this is Caesar with Toxic Baits. I'm gonna do a little review for uh, these Spiralites with bait rods. This is the 8.6 uh, Defiant and Maverick. I don't have any status quo on me, but that's the basic same blank as the Maverick, the 30 ton, eight foot six. These are rated from um, two to 10 ounces. So the difference between the Maverick series and the Defiant series is the 30 and the 40 ton graphite. The 40 ton graphite is a lot lighter, has a, a, a lot faster response time. It feels a little more crisp. The action is a little faster, not slow like the Maverick. So for my preference, I prefer to throw my like six to nine to 10 ounce hard baits on this Maverick series rod, the one piece. We offer a one piece and a telescopic in both lines um, with the spiral guides. In the Defiant series, you're gonna see this wind grip, full length, all the way down, kind of slick looking, little foregrip on there. You got your tiger wrap um, and your wrap guide, it's pretty basic. When you jump to the Maverick series, you have the full EVA foam grip, same length, very comfortable. That's what I've always used with swim bait, uh, with swim bait rods is the foam. I actually prefer the wind grip, um, but they're both equally comfortable. I just think the wind grip looks, you know, looks slick. This has no foregrip, so I feel the 30 ton has more par parabolic bend and is better suited for baits such as the Optimum Ballum 300. Um, this is one of my weight drinks in the six ounce category, lift weight bait. Large rat, 11 inch triple trout, one of my 10 inch shiners. Um, this is a great rod for these big treble baits in that range without getting them thrown. It has a really deep bend. I don't and I don't really feel that it handles the 11 ounce up style baits well, and I also prefer a faster action for my soft baits. If you want a pair of bulk action for some line throughs, the Maverick is a pretty good rod on the 8.6 for these larger, this is the 9 inch Osprey, this is the 9 inch SKT, um, there's also the Thumper Tail and the Alpha. I prefer to throw these on the 8 foot 3 series Defiant because I like the crisper action for the soft baits. Um, so when I move up to the Defiant series, this is when I'm really looking to throw the absolute big stuff. It's rated the same two to 10, but I actively throw my 11 and a half ounce, 12 inch glide bait without an issue. Should cut to a clip here to show the action of me throwing it. Um, large soft baits like the 12 inch Osprey, I know a lot of these, a lot of people don't give these too much play. Uh, Rago SKT 11 inch, this is a 10 and a half ounce soft bait. It's, it's a great rod to chuck these, but it still has the backbone to drive the hook home regardless of the mouth, uh, the fish having a mouthful of plastic. Um, you could also throw the 12 inch Savage gears on them. It seems like you really have to move this bait a lot to get hooks into the fish. So I prefer to have as much backbone as I can. So these 12 inch line through Savage gears are great baits and uh, I prefer to throw them on this uh, Defiant 8 foot 6. Uh, so these are the reels that I recommend for these and they fit really nice. This is a, just a normal Kago Millionaire 300. It's the same size as the 400 Shimano series. Big wide round reel. Mounts up really nice. Balances on there. If you like low pro, this is a uh, Lexa 400. It's a very large low pro reel, but a lot of guys like the big shooters, uh, you know, the 60 wide Aboos. I think they're a little smaller than this, but they still have some heft to them, some weight, and they balance really well for these big baits on these rods. I also like to throw this 300 series when I'm not dealing with the super big stuff, maybe like this six ounce wide here, the Ballum on the, on the, uh, on the Maverick series. This is a regular Lexa 300, Trance 300, um, if you like lose whatever low profile real 300 wide, th those still balance very well in these rods because they're so light. Um, so besides that, we offer these in a telescopic, like this Defiant series here, and also in a one piece line. Um, so 
if you're on the fence or if you're uh, in a kayak, if you shore bang and your car is small and you don't really want to tote around that 8.6 swim bait rod all the time, these things break down to under 7 foot 6. You can slide them in, pop them out, good to go. That's the rod I've been throwing my 11 ounce glide bait on without issue is the telescopic version. The one piece versions are beasts, of course. You know, for dedicated swim bait anglers, I know that it's no issue to throw an eight and six rod, but we do have both options. So if you're in the if you're in the market for a big bait rod, whether it be big hard baits, big soft baits, unless you're throwing the really gigantic stuff that's over 12, 13 ounces, 13 inch baits, we definitely have a rod for you in this eight six series, the Defiant or the Maverick. You know, the Defiant where you look at two hundred and twenty nine dollars for forty ton graphite, everything high quality components and the Maverick's only 119 it's not a it's, it's not an inferior rod it just uses a 30 ton blank which has I don't have I don't have a preference over one or the other I prefer the Defiant for certain baits and I prefer the spot uh, the Maverick for certain baits um, I prefer the Maverick for my mid-range large treble baits and my Defiant is what I it is what I go to for the super heavy big baits I really have to move a fish out of cover. So whatever you decide to pick up, you can't go wrong. Head out, when we drop these, go out and grab some Spiralites with confidence. We built these to perform for you. Spiralite is performance perfected. Don't doubt it. Thanks a lot.